the final location for the day. Uh, we were at Port Wen Brickworks, an abandoned brickworks uh, north of Hollyhead, in between Hollyhead and Bangor. And uh, yeah, it's, it's a cracking little place to be honest. Didn't expect it to be on this scale, I was expecting it to be just like a few buildings and that, but yeah, it's cracking. cracking place, so we split up so we can go do our shots in there. We're currently at this end, which admittedly I think I've chosen the wrong end to start at because the floor's gone. So I won't be going that way, and if I turn the camera around, that's all muddy, and I don't want to get muddy. So I don't think I'm missing much by not going that way anyway, but yeah, it's literally right on the coast obviously enabling supplies to come in and out easily uh, into the oh get your bearings right there Irish Sea so yeah we're going to do a, a walkthrough now of this location I'm going to stop to take pictures so yeah fast should be good right so I've stepped down from that building on the right and I'm right by the old harbour wall well, I assume it was the harbour wall it looks like it's just collapsed in now anyway some down at the lowest level we've got some of the furnaces there we've got the chimney so let's take a walk up here and try not to break my neck I wish that wind would do one because in my island vlog, which is like the last video I put up, technically, um, that was windy as hell. And now here I am in North Wales, and it's uh, still windy. To the sea. And the coastline, the epic coastline. Okay, so here we are, right under one of the furnaces. Chimney out building. Okay, finished my uh, photo shoot, so I'm gonna give you a quick guided tour of the site. Come across this discarded, I assume it's a boiler, and it looks to be full of slag. Trying to get the camera comfy a minute. Apologies for the shaky footage. I can't get over the amount of volcanic rock that is here. That's just insane. Anywho, so these are the three uh, furnaces then, as such, that we use for smelting raw materials, etc. And the finished product is the rock arch over there. So those two furnaces are clean inside. But, this one still shows signs of when it was used, i.e. when it was burnt. So imagine all the raw materials in here being melted, smelted together, all the sand that was used as well in the process. And then a cracking view out through there. With a lovely house on its own on the cliffside, overlooking the sea. Apparently this location is uh, very popular with wild campers. It's easy to understand why. So, we shall continue our journey. So that's the other two furnaces there. 
Then we've got another tower here, which looks to be an incredibly far from collapsing. Looking at the cracks in the brick. So, we're not going to dilly dally. Even though we are exploring dangerous places, our safety is paramount, so we don't want to be hanging around for too long. As you see there, one of the ceiling girders has come down, and nature has reclaimed this area, largely. It's amazing how quick um, nature comes in and reclaims these places after we've gone. Some more dereliction. That's the smoke the stack we were at earlier. And if we put my head on here, there we go. There's the building we were stood at at the beginning of this segment. So we cut back in through this room. Some more tags. And just through there is another furnace. I have to admit, I took a load of photos in here because I just love the composition of the shot. You've got all this building in the foreground, the wall's gone, and then you've got the furnace in the background. Amazing. So we've got some pipes here. I don't know what they'll be used for, for pump, pumping water, etc. Potentially another little furnace there. I don't know what that is. If you do know what it was used for, let us know in the comments box below. And then back round then to this area. Some more boilers. And more uh, ovens, basically. And you still got remnants of ash and charred materials inside and rubbish because people have been fly tipping because why not, you know, why not? waste all your energy bringing your rubbish out here and not take it to your local tip. <sighs> Some people, uh, I despair, but that's a topic for another video. This is about exploring. So yeah, I'll take you into one more furnace and then we'll end the video. So, excuse me if this goes a bit shaky. Because I have to stoop down. Become a hobbit, the brewery. I'm inside. Right. And as you can see, there's some burning evident in this room. And a blue wax on the wall. Is there treasure behind it? Is this a hollow wall? No, it's not. Damn, that would have ended the day nice, wouldn't it? Finding some hidden treasure. So, there we go. That's my latest exploring video. Hope you liked it. All around Anglesey in North Wales. Leave a comment, rate and subscribe if you can. Your support is always appreciated. Until next time, ta -ra.